Let's talk about Sherlock, the tool that turns who is this guy into, oh, so that's who this guy is. That slick Twitter bot claiming to be a Fortune 500 CEO. Sherlock doesn't just find their LinkedIn. It drags their digital skeletons out of the closet, MySpace profiles, abandoned coding blogs, even their RuneScape guild name from 2012. Pro tip, use slash slash timeout 10 so Sherlock doesn't rage quit when websites block it. Think of it like asking politely, hey, did this clown ever sign up here? Instead of kicking the door down. Meet Maltego, the tool that turns a single phishing email into a true crime documentary. That sketchy, urgent payment note? Drop it in Maltego, and Maltego doesn't just map the scammer server, it finds the Wi-Fi network they used at a cafe in Bucharest called Coffee and Crime. I once traced a ransomware gang to a server farm inside a bakery. Their SSL certificate, Secure Croissant, com. Their malware payloads, named after French pastries. Eclair.exe wasn't just a joke. It encrypted files faster than you can imagine. Let's talk about Shodan, the search engine that answers the question, what the actual fuck is connected to the internet? Type webcam and boom, you're staring at a dentist's office in Ohio where someone's getting a root canal at 3 a.m. Type port colon 21 and you'll find 50,000 FTP servers with logins like admin or guest. Because who needs security when you've got convenience, right? Now do yourself a favor. Scan your IP in Shodan. If you see your toaster listed, Unplug it. Now, if your printer's been quietly hosting a Bitcoin miner since 2017, burn it. And if your smart fridge is on Shodan, maybe stop bragging about your smart home. Meet the Harvester, the OSINT tool that scours 120 plus sources to find what companies think is hidden. LinkedIn profiles, PGP key directories, even random pastebin dumps where someone accidentally pasted a database password next to their grocery list. Found a corporate domain? Run it on the Harvester and you'll get emails, employee roles, and servers. But here's the kicker. People reuse passwords everywhere. That security admin account turns out Coffee123 isn't just their Starbucks order. And here's a pro tip. Pair the harvester with tools like LinkedIn to auto-verify employees. Meet Social Links, the tool that turns curated personas into cautionary tales. Because while your feed says private island, your metadata screams Ikea futon. This isn't just a post tracker. It's a behavior profiler. That luxury traveler, their deleted tweets mention budgeting for instant noodles. Their Flickr albums exaf data. Geo tags a suburban basement, not the Amalfi Coast. Use social links to fact check influencers, verify sources, or spot deepfake trends. But let's be clear, this isn't for decoding your ex's solo trip with a mysterious sandal wearing shadow. Now comes Spiderfoot, the lazy genius of OSINT. It does the sleuthing so you don't have to. Why manually stalk when an algorithm can stalk better? That crypto enthusiast? Their email's been pawned more times than a pinata at a birthday party. And that startup they mentioned? The Woy's records trace back to a P.O. box in a tax haven. But hey, at least they do love puppies. Probably. Spiderfoot doesn't just find breadcrumbs. It bakes the whole loaf. Breaches, domains, crypto wallets. Even that sketchy Reddit AMA that they deleted. Pro move. Use this to vet your own email. Turns out coffee one, two, three exclamation mark was in seven breaches. Whoops. Meet Mataka, the paranoid genius living in your browser. It's the spidey sense for the internet's dark alleys. Right-click anything, an IP, a domain, a crypto wallet, and Mataka will either yawn or scream, run, that life-changing crypto deal. Mataka just traced the wallet to a malware farm powering 12 ransomware attacks. But hey, at least the ROI on prison time is low. Pair Mataka with virus total or abuse IPDB to double-check threats. But remember, scanning your neighbor's Wi-Fi for funsies makes you the creep. Scanning your own Wi-Fi? That's just good hygiene. FACA, the tool that doesn't just analyze files, it roasts them. That confidential report? FOCA just told the room it was drafted on a museum piece laptop during the Bush administration. FOCA digs through document metadata like a nosy historian, exposing hidden authors, ancient software, and that one intern who edited everything. Pro tip, if your 2024 financial forecast was last saved on Windows 95, you don't need an auditor, you need a time machine. Grep.app, the search engine that scans 50 million code repositories for your worst mistakes. That encrypted API key? It's already here, sitting in a repo. Devs use Grep.app to find code snippets, and sysadmins use it to find out which of their devs should be fired. Pro tip, if your secret config has a comment saying, to do, remove before commit, congratulations, it's now internet folklore. Pro move, pair Grep.app with GitGuardian to scan repos in real time. Or just pre-write your resignation letter now. Statistically, you'll need it.